The ECB could be gearing up to pay out again, according to a Bloomberg survey. Eurozone lenders may tap the central bank for close to half a trillion euros in the next round of three-year funds. Our Europe editor, David Tweed, joins us now. And so this is happening. Well, well, first of all, just take us through exactly what we know in terms of how much the banks might take up in the next round of liquidity measures. Well, we've just done a survey, 30 analysts that we've spoken to, and they're estimating that the take-up of these loans over three years could be 470 billion euros. Now, that's slightly less than mm. last time, because the first time they did it in December, it was 489 right. billion euros. But you know, it was very, very effective, this whole thing. I mean, you can, you can say that this, this, this really bought banks time to lower their debt. Markets rallied. You saw, uh, you saw in money going into mm. high-yielding uh, uh, securities. We've seen a very good rally in the European stock markets on the back of it. But one of the other key things, though, is that you've seen the commercial banking, the commercial market open as well, with banks like Intesa San Paolo and Société Générale in France um, issuing into the unsecured debt market, both issuing five-year bonds. So in a way, it's opened that market as well. So it has been very successful. What else is the money being used for? Well, the money... <coughs> also, it's going into the government bond markets. Yeah. That's one of the clear things. But I think one of the reasons why it's going to be very important to look at the number is, and it could be taken both ways, because if the number comes in below that 470, you could have disappointment in the markets that not enough money is going to go in there, and you could see the markets actually retracing some of the gains that they've been making. But if it comes out above that, then it could be turned around. You could look at it and say, oh, dear, this is a symptom of the weakness of the European banks but also it's going to give the impression that this strength we've seen in the markets is coming completely at the largesse of the European Central Bank's yes. balance sheet. So it's, 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 it's going to be uh, really open to interpretation once the numbers come out, and that will be announced on the 29th.